My name is Jasmine Simone. So for today's video, I'll be doing a Shein fall haul. So I got a ton of cute, affordable pieces for the fall to show you guys. Everything will be linked in the description below if you guys are interested in checking something out. And also, I will be doing a lookbook with some of these pieces on how I style these items as well. So if you want to check that out, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below. And without further ado, I'm not going to waste you guys time. We're just going to get right on into it. So I'm going to start off with the top first. And the first set of top that I got are these little like cami strap tank top. Really got these so I could just wear them under cardigan because I did get a lot of cardigans and sweaters and you guys will see that in a few. So I feel like just having these basic were perfect especially if I'm gonna be wearing a lot of cardigans or like light, light jackets in the fall. So it came in a pack of four. So this is the first one. It came in white and then another color is like a tan or like apricot and then it also came in like this brown color and then for the final one is black of course and i got these in a size small what i do like about them is that they're very soft and they're not like super duper thin so it really do have like a nice thickness to it without it being like super thin and from what i recall they weren't really like super see-through either so you can definitely choose a bunch of different color options if you guys don't want like the brown mix they also just have black and white or like i said they have black and gray and a few other colors as well. okay and then moving on to the next set of top that i got i got these like long sleeve white shirt and i also got one of like a tannish color too you guys will see that in a minute i like it kind of got that like asymmetrical look and it's kind of like off the shoulder which you guys will see on the side here i thought this was very cute because i think this could go with a lot of things this could definitely go with like a nice pair of jeans and maybe some boots and then also maybe like a little denim skirt a long denim skirt yeah cargo skirt like you can definitely do a lot with this shirt you can dress it up or down and then i have got this in a size small as well um it's also very very stretchy so i would definitely say get your normal size my only concern with this shirt is that from what i remember it was definitely just a little bit see-through but i mean if you have a black bra on it shouldn't be no issue and then like i said i did get this in like a tannish color so this is what it looks like in tan and then i think with the the brown you could also do a little more like a monochromatic look like you could wear like all brown or like different shades of brown and i think this will look very very cute okay now moving on to the last top that i got for this haul so i had got of course a nice plaid top so this is one that i got it's like different shades of brown so it's mainly like a tannish color but it also has a little mix of like dark brown as well and i feel like with a plaid shirt you can style this in a lot of different ways too either like a nice pair of jeans and some sneakers or even maybe like a jumpsuit so for this one i probably would definitely paired with like a brown long sleeve jumpsuit that I have and I might dial this for my fall lookbook so y'all can see that in a minute and then this one is not super long I would say it definitely comes maybe like a little past the waist but if you want it to be a lot longer then I would definitely suggest maybe sizing up so for me I had got this shirt in a size small and it fit just how I wanted to sometime every now and then I might want to oversize slip and also if it is too long for you um something you could do to it kind of just like tie it up i like to wear it up like that as well this shirt it does have like a nice soft feel to it but it is not super duper thick so probably wear this over like some long sleeve if it's like a lot cooler or maybe even like one of those tank tops that i showed you guys in the beginning that would work too okay so now i'm about to move on to sweaters and cardigans and i got a lot of those so basically this is the first one that i got this one is sleeveless and it does have like a nice little like turtleneck and because it's sleeveless i did get this to make just put under like a cardigan or maybe a jacket of some sort this one has a very nice material too it's not like super duper thick like a regular sweater it does feel pretty good definitely feel very much comfortable and then I do like that it is very very stretchy and I did get this in a size small as well okay and moving on to the next sweater I got so this is another like cream sweater this one is crop and it kind of has like a distressed look at the bottom and I like this because it's very, very cute. It does have a couple buttons going up in the center. And this sweater is actually really, really thick, which I love. So I think you can still put maybe like a little crop top or like a little cami top underneath it. I got this in a size small. And I think you can pair this a lot of different ways too. Like I said, I think this could also go well with some jeans and maybe like a skirt as well. You can kind of make this streetwear too if you have like some kind of nice like distressed jeans. I just got a nice pair of like distressed jeans that kind of has like a little cream in it from Fashion Nova. So I think 
think this might go well with that and let me know if i should do like a separate little fashion over video too i got a couple themes from there but i don't know if it's enough to do like a haul or maybe i could just do a mini haul but anyway let me know in the comment below if you guys want like a fall fashion over haul as well and then moving on to the next sweaters i got so the next one i have i got in multiple different colors i got these asymmetrical sweaters and these are very very cute these are really really soft definitely not as thick as the last sweater that i showed you guys and i also love that the bottom right here also have like an asymmetrical look it kind of got like a little tail and then also on the edge of like the sleeve it does have like a little bit of like ripple effect and then i have got all of these in a size small and like i said these are very very cute definitely can be worn with some jeans and some nice boots so the first color that i got in in the gray and then i also got it in a nice little cream or like beige color this is very very cute i feel like this is a nice fall color too and then of course i also got it in pink and then the next sweater i got is another little cream sweater i'm just realizing that i got a lot of cream sweaters so this one is more like a off the top sweater and i love the sleeve because it has these little like drawstring it got this drawstring tie at the bottom which i think is so so cute this sweater is also very sick very very stretchy too i got this in a size small and then i think the only thing about this sweater was that this one was also a little bit see-through too so i think you definitely should wear like some kind of little camry top or something underneath this would definitely be cute i think i would definitely wear it if it was like a denim skirt or something and maybe like some long boots i think that would be very very cute and feminine and girly and then this is the next sweater that i got this is a really really nice olive green color and it does have like this zipper going down the middle i really wanted to love this sweater and i still think it's really really cute i just didn't like how it fit on me because the shoulders was a little too loose i don't really have broad shoulders like mine is just very like petite so it just kept kind of like slipping down so maybe i could size down a little bit so i would say if your body type is a little similar to mine definitely size down unless you do have like the broader shoulders then it might not be an issue for you but for me, it was just way too loose on the top and I don't need any wardrobe malfunction when I'm outside. So <laughs> this is definitely going to have to go back. I definitely love how, you know, you got the zipper going down. Um, I love the color. The material is great. It is super duper thick. I think this is definitely one of the thickest sweaters that I have shown you guys so far. Yeah, I mean, overall, it was just very cute. They have multiple different colors to me from what I remember. Okay, so now I'm about to move on to the cardigan. So this is the very first one that I have. So this one is a crop cardigan it is burgundy burgundy it's definitely a nice fall color and i would say this does have like a nice thickness to it and like i said it is cropped so it is short and then the way i would style this i do have like a burgundy yankees hat so i would definitely wear that with this sweater and then i probably would just pair with like some nice maybe for baggy but maybe just more like straight leg jeans and maybe some air force one i think that'd be really cute and then the next cardigan i have is definitely one of my favorite items in this haul it is a nice like brown kind of got like a little zebra print going on but it has like a dark brown and then just more of that like tannish color and I think this is so cute. I love the quality and I love the material too. It is super duper thick so this one you can wear with like either a tank top but you're definitely going to be warm for fall and winter for sure. I got this in a small and I think the best way this can be styled is with either maybe like a brown jumpsuit that's what I had in mind and you guys might see in my future lookbook when I do style it or maybe just like a brown bodysuit or something and then some jeans and some boots. I think that'd be cute as well or maybe you can even put like a dress with it too i think that'd be cute too and then moving on to the next sweater that i got so this one is a very very long gray cardigan it comes all the way down to my ankles but i do love the um material of it it's very soft very stretchy and i would say the arms are definitely a lot tighter than most of the sweaters i have and then it also come with these little like ties that you can tie in the center and i think that is just very very cute i have got this in a size small and like i said i'm 5'3 and it comes down all the way like down near to my ankle for this sweater i would definitely style it with maybe i don't know this could be styled in a different way too i would say either like a jumpsuit or like a nice pair of jeans and just like a little top to go underneath i think that'd be pretty cute and then this is going to be the last cardigan that i got for this haul so this one is also another long one not as long as the gray one that i just showed you guys but this one probably comes maybe past my knees this one also has some like pockets in the front like i said very very thick this is in a size small if you want more like an oversized look you can size up but to me it's already like big enough it is i would say more loose on the arms as well kind of like i've been saying like the cardigan really can be put together with a lot of different things definitely like a jumpsuit or just like a regular top and jeans and now i'm about to move on to the couple bottoms that i got for this haul 
So this is the very first one. I had got this little like mini skirt. I really love how it looked. It was really, really cute. I like the color and I did try it on with a couple things that I got in the haul and it came out looking really cute. It's just very short. Like <laughs> my booty cheeks were dang near out in the back when I had bent over or when I was just standing up too. So I don't know. I don't know I do like it a lot and I have put it on with one of the long cardigans and you really can't you know see the back so that's not an issue but I don't know I don't want my cheeks to be out when I'm you know outside but I love the cut I really do love everything about it um I would say the material for this is definitely a lot thinner it's not very thick at all but maybe if I do take it back I might just look for like a longer one I might thug it out but I might not I'm not sure and I had got this in a size small too but it's just very very short in the back and like I said I am five and then I have also got me a nice pair of straight leg jeans so they're pretty much just like a medium watch color and then they also got like one little rip slip right here and at first when I first opened the package to me the legs look really big I was concerned that it was just gonna be a little too baggy for me but once I put them on they actually look pretty good and then I had got these in a size 27 which is also equivalent to like a US size maybe three or four but yeah these are actually really comfortable and I tried it on with a lot of the things that I got in this haul too and I feel like it goes good with everything and I would say these jeans are not super thick they kind of feel like the same thickness as the skirt that I just showed you right and then now moving on to this little two-piece set that I had got so this two-piece set is more like a sweater set so it came with a skirt and then on the skirt it also kind of had this light denim look and the sweater material on this skirt is really really soft and then this is the sweater that came with it so this is the top and it is just like a regular little cream sweater but it does have like a little denim pocket i would say this is also one of my other favorite items in the haul too cute and i think it could definitely go well with like some denim boots because it doesn't have like a lot of denim you definitely want to bring that denim out a little bit and then i had got this set in a size small and like i said um material very soft and it's also very stretchy too and now i'm moving on to like the last little couple like puffer or little jacket that i got so the first one i got is this little like puffer vest and I got it in black surprisingly I didn't have any black ones yet but I think this definitely goes well with like a jumpsuit or maybe even like all black maybe like a black long sleeve and some black pants the puff is not like super duper thick so that's why I think it's perfect for fall rather than just like winter time but I had got this in a size small and to me it does have like a little bit of a crop look as you guys can see it's not very long and then the next jacket that I got is a nice little cream puffer coat this one is actually really nice quality it's definitely a lot thicker than that vest that I showed you guys what I like about this puff um is that it actually do come with a hood and i feel like most of them that you find nowadays it really doesn't come with a hood but yeah like i said nice and thick and it definitely is more crop and it also is a zip up as well and then i had got this in a size small if you want more of an oversized look definitely size up for surely and then for this i would definitely say probably just like some jeans and some nice pair of like tennis shoes or maybe like some ugg boots all right y'all so those are pretty much all the items that i have for this haul definitely comment below which item was your favorite and and definitely be sure to stay tuned and subscribe if you guys want to see how I style a majority of these outfits that I have. I am going to do a lookbook next. But if you don't want to wait for the lookbook, definitely check out some of my other lookbooks. I have plenty of like fall outfits I did from the past. Also, let me know if I should do like a little mini fashion of a haul or maybe I could just show the items in the lookbook as well. And without further ado, be sure to give this video a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.